Hello everyone, it's Mike Armstrong here, a.k.a. the Welsh Dragon. I was just watching the news in bed uh, about COP26 and I come, uh, I thought about uh, an idea basically for doing a video. And then I thought, well, you know, why put off till tomorrow, something that you can do today? Just like taking action on climate change is important now and we can't afford to put it off to tomorrow. I couldn't afford to put this video off any longer. So I just thought I'd come on and have a chat about COP26. Um, obviously, it's all over the news at the moment. And what I wanted to sort of come on and talk about is that we can't rely on politicians to make a big difference in this world because a lot of politicians haven't really got a clue what they're doing. And generally, it's the hardworking entrepreneurs of the planet and the hardworking people of the planet that make a difference. So forget about COP26 and whatever's going on there. What we've got to think about is uh, how can we be innovative, creative, and make a difference to the planet. And if we all try hard and work hard on that as a, a, a challenge for each of us, and we all try and make a difference, then, you know, just like with uh, COVID, you know, the more people are working on something, the more entrepreneurs and investment and uh, the more, you know, energy that goes into uh, one thing, one challenge, the more likely we are to make it happen. So, uh, you know, as entrepreneurs, individual entrepreneurs, let's get creative. Let's find a way of, you know, reducing our impact as business owners. And if we all did that collectively, then we'd make a big difference. And most business owners are leaders in their community anyway. So, you know, just to give you an idea, I myself have stopped upgrading, you know, phones and clothes and cars and whatever a long time ago now. One, you know, you're just basically filling the coffers of, you know, sales and marketing departments and corporate companies and big brands and that sort of thing. So, you know, and you're putting pressure on yourself to go out and have to earn money and pay for all these things. But also you're massively depleting the, the world's resources. So you've got to start being um, non-selfish, start thinking about the, the planet as a whole and just work work out what you can cut back, you know. It takes the pressure off you anyway. You know, people go out there and they're working their backsides off so they can have the latest clothes, the latest phone, the latest car, the latest everything. And like, why? Why do you need the latest? You know, it's just about ego. It's about greed. So sometimes you've got to, you know, park the ego, park the greed and work out what's best for everybody and the planet being in a healthy position. And, uh, you know, you being under less pressure and stress uh, is, a, is what's best for everybody. So, you know, work out what you can do, how you can make a difference. I know us on our own can't make a big difference, but if we all collectively do it together, we can make a huge difference. So start getting getting thinking, get your pen out, get your pad out, work out what you can make cutbacks, work out what you don't need to constantly keep purchasing and buying and wasting resources. Do an analysis of where you are now, you know, and where you can make cutbacks, where you can save, where you can be creative and innovate. And let's do what entrepreneurs do and go out and fix things, solve problems and make a difference. That's it from me, Mike Armstrong, a.k.a. The Welsh Dragon, breathing fire into the next generation of entrepreneurs and hoping that some of you entrepreneurs out there are going to be, get creative, be inventive and come up with the next solutions that we need for the next 20, 30, 50, 100 years or so. Cheers. Bye-bye.